GGG, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. CodingFace.com. Listen, your boy is back. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like this video. And also, when you get a chance, go to my website, CodingFace.com. Subscribe there. Put in your information. Most likely, I'll give you a free course. Bow. All right. So I'm going over my stats, which is pretty great. I think I've done pretty great in the past two, three months. And, you know, my channel is going up every single day. But that's not the point. The point where I come to the stats is to basically see exactly which are the videos that people want to see and which ones they don't want to see. And something that I noticed, which is very important, a lot of people, they want to find videos that's going to give them the easy route of saying, hey, become a web developer, you know, in fucking two weeks. Become a, a you know, freelancer in one day. I'll teach you all the, the tricks and tips and whatever the fuck you want to say <laughs> on a video to basically catch the attention of people. Because one thing that you got to notice is that a lot of people don't want to put in the work. Do you know how many people sign up to courses on Udemy, right? They sign, a lot of people sign up on courses on Udemy, but then they don't finish it. Or most of the time they go through it and only do like, 10 20 percent of it right because it takes time right and there's a lot of people also to you know not to bring up uh coding boot camps but a lot of people go to these boot camps with the hope of becoming a developer in three months and then they're like okay i got uh my little bullshit certificate that says hey i went to whatever fucking boot camp and now i'm a web developer it doesn't work like that guys you have to actually put in the work just because also and just because you did a course on on Udemy or just because you did a few projects on, on YouTube and just because you did one month in fucking Team Treehouse that doesn't mean that you're a developer yet like and when I say that it's like okay people are like oh soon as you make a web page you're a developer soon as you do this and that and I'm like no no you're not because you still don't even have the skills that it takes to become like a full developer like I don't know maybe later on you guys will understand because I say this like a lot of times I've noticed that people just want the easy easy road to this thing and they don't understand like hey man you gotta go out your way and basically start making projects like you have to build projects I'm going to continue repeating this in every video. You got to create projects. Stop just doing the tutorials and say, hey, I know how to build a, a HTML page. And then you don't build nothing for like two weeks. Everything that you learned from a video or from a course on Udemy is gone in like two weeks because you haven't practiced it. It's, this thing is not like, oh, yeah, like once you learn it and it's like riding a bike. No, it's not like fucking riding a bike. Your brain doesn't work like that. This is something that it can get complicated because you have to practice it. If you leave it alone, you're going to come back and you're going to be rusty. You know what I mean? You can't just keep leaving, you know, learning web development. It's like, hey, I'll learn in two days and then I'll, you know, I won't touch it till next week. It doesn't work like that. You have to take this thing serious. All right, guys? And, you know, like, I want to say this, man. My videos right now, the ones that should be popular right now, should be the tutorials. And which tutorials? I will say um, the Learn HTML CSS by Building Netflix. The other one, which is Learn um, HTML CSS by Building Instagram. Like Those should be the most popular ones. Because you guys should not only come here just because I come here and talk to you guys you guys should come here to try to learn something and learn take the knowledge that I give you and then if I if you know if you don't want to take the the tutorials that I make cool take one of the courses that I put in the description because those courses work like you don't have to like me you might say man I like the guy but I can't fucking learn from him and that's fine you don't have to learn from me but I can guarantee you the, the courses that are on my description, they're going to teach you how to become a web developer. But at the same time, I don't want to say, hey, guys, this is guaranteed because 
the only way this thing's gonna be guaranteed that you're gonna become a developer is if you want to be a developer not because I tell you hey take this course or hey take this this bullshit boot camp or hey go to this community to college or hey go here whatever the fuck I give you it doesn't work like that it's all up to you only you could do this nobody's gonna be able to hold your hand and, and make you a developer this is something that you have to like to do you have to be able to be a problem solver because you gotta understand this most of the job and most of the, the number let's say like this cut it down bring it back get my thoughts together the number one thing that you gotta learn to become a, a web developer is to become a problem solver right and be able to look online meaning Google Stack Overflow Quora um, the documentation of whatever you're working on it could be a language could be a, a framework it could be a library make sure to understand how to look to things in the documentation right all of this stuff takes time and it takes work this is not something that's gonna be easy for people to understand in a month in two months in three months there's people that are lucky that just you know I've, I've got people where they hit me up and they're like oh man I watched this video from Chris Sean like oh he got in in three months but man that was the determination it wasn't the time frame of him becoming a, a developer in three months it wasn't like hey this is the set time it only takes three months to become a developer no it doesn't work like that what took him that you know that small amount of time was the determination he went hard he went like super hard if you haven't looked at his story look it up go to his channel the kid went hard he didn't just be like hey I'm gonna become a developer in three months it doesn't work like that you have to put it put everything into it and be like yo I'm just gonna fucking do this shit man and do this shift three four hours if you gotta wake up early in the morning wake up early in the morning five five o'clock in the morning do two hours and then when you get home at six seven o'clock do another hour that's just how you gotta do it man it's like going to the gym man it's like i think of like learning how to become a, a web developer like going to the gym you can't expect to go get a six pack <laughs> by basically working out one hour of the week it's not gonna fucking work you know what I mean like you have to do that shit almost every fucking day you know at least for a set amount of time so your body could get used to it and it's the same thing as the the brain you have to go hard for the next you know three months three to six months you have to go fucking hard this is not like oh I'm doing it part-time no this you gotta fucking go hard if not, it's going to take you a year, two years to learn this shit. I keep getting emails from people that are like, oh, I've been doing this for a year and I don't know if I'm ready. You know why those people are not ready? And I'm sorry, guys, that you know you guys send me messages. It's because you guys haven't been able to go hard. Either things that's in your life, either stopping you, you know, family, friends, uh, you know, having a full-time job. And all those things are stopping you guys from basically going super hard and saying, hey, I'm going to take fucking this three months of learning web development three to fucking eight hours a day. If you could do that, freaking do it, man. If you can't do it, do at least two hours a day, man. And the weekend, you got to fucking go hard. And the like, I'm sorry I'm cursing, but on the weekends, you have to fucking go hard. Like, stop fucking hanging out with your friends. Start chilling with your girlfriend. Tell your girlfriend, listen, listen, baby, I have to do this. Because if I want to change my life, I have to be able to fucking become a developer in the next few months. If she can't understand that, that's not the woman for you. Or that's not the man for you. You know what I mean? Like, you have to, or even your friends. If your friends can't understand that, cut them off, man. Those are not friends that you need. Because they're probably not doing shit with their lives. Most people that are fucking busy and making money and fucking being successful, they're busy every fucking second. Like right now, I'm just getting a little taste. I feel like I'm getting a little, little taste of being successful. I have a, a beautiful wife, well, fiance. We had not married yet. But 
beautiful wife, uh, <laughs> fiance, beautiful fucking kid on the way. I got a beautiful life. My mom's here. I got a nice crib. I got money coming in. I'm not worried about paying no bills because everything is already there. All the money that I need for the next six months is there. Like, I don't even have to think about it rent i don't have to think about car i don't have to think about nothing everything's already there i have the money there to pay for the next six months and everything's going good with youtube and everything's going good with like you know my website like all of this good stuff is coming now and you know what what's happening i don't have time to do anything like i have my friends hitting me up on on Instagram and messaging me is like, hey man, let's hang out, let's uh, let's hang out and shit. And I'm like, man, I don't even know when am I gonna have time to hang out because I'm so busy. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm constantly coding, I'm constantly learning new things, I'm constantly making videos from here, I'm constantly thinking of new ideas of what I'm building on my website. Like, and then on top of that, I got a full-time job, which I got to think, like, tomorrow, I got to think about all the new things that I got to build for that website, that company that I work for. So, I don't have time for anything. So, you guys shouldn't have time for anything either. Meaning, you, if you want to become this, just go hard, man. And trust me, after that, you could just chill. And after you already have a job and you're already working at a company, just do the work from your company if you want to. Because at the same time, you could get burnt out too if you do too much. But in the beginning, man, you just have to take it. It's like going to fucking, you know, going to the army or something. Like you have to go through a, a certain type of test to become, you know, that freaking army officer or whatever. Or that marine. Like you just have to go hard, guys. All right, man. Stop thinking that you're going to find here on the internet the easy route. The, you know, here's the quick, easy way to become a developer in two months, in one month, in three months, in four months. It doesn't work like that. Everybody's different. It depends how much time you put into this. You know what I mean? So just go hard. Start, stop looking for the easy answer because it's not there. All you're going to find, especially from this channel, there's no easy answers to this. It's just pretty much, if you want to become a developer, courses that I guarantee are good are the ones below. Now, do you want to come here and listen to me talk? That's fine and that's cool because that's helping me. I, I'm, I get a little cut from YouTube, you know, that little bullshit, what is it, like $200 a month <laughs> for people coming here. I, I'm going to get that regardless because people's going to come here and watch my videos. But if you come here and you spend time watching me, leave out of here with something. Don't just come here. You're, don't come and give me your time. Give me your time and take my knowledge. All right? All right, guys. I'll see you later. You already know. It's your boy Joe. Back at it again, man. Codingface.com. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like this video. Your boy is back. All right? Bow.